What's up folks, for this week's video we're back with another review and this time I got something to drink and I saw this product on the mere coincidence because I was just grocery shopping I thought I was just like <gasps> limited edition and I was like I gotta try this so the product that I will be reviewing is Venner's Black Cherry Ginger Soda. I can't say the brand correctly. I don't know why I struggle saying it, so I'm just going to say Venner's. So if I'm saying it wrong, excuse that. I, I don't know why. I just call it Ginger Ale because it is, technically it is Ginger Ale. But anyways, this just came back on the market after being gone for like 10 years for what I read. And I was like... I need to know how it tastes like. I have a feeling that I am not going to like this at all because so far black cherry flavors, yeah, they always end up tasting like medicine and I always hate that and I'm just like, ugh, disgusting. But I'm going to give this a chance just to try it because it is a limited edition and it's going fast quickly. In fact, I just read somewhere that they're going to stop coming out with this and it's very very limited because they just brought this back so we should try it but before we try it let me tell you a little bit more of this product shall we so it said to that they're bringing this for a living to a and it's only for like in the summer so that's why it's going way fast and there is not a lot of reviews on this product it's just a bunch of youtube uh youtubers like Saying this, saying they got it over Amazon because it's only exclusive in one state for some odd reason. So I had to, I got this by mere luck. So for this product, it was said to be taste like cherry and it's supposed to be refreshing and supposed to be less caffeinated as the usual soda, which is weird because it is a soda, so it's most likely be caffeinated regardless if it's less or not so there was not a lot much I could find on this product I was just like eh. it there was just not a lot of information about this which is kind of weird it was just like I don't know much about it just saying like oh it's available here and if you want it you have to get it on Amazon Kroger yada yada so if you were to find it in your local stores you're lucky and I thought that was very weird because I was just like why in one specific state oh well I mean, oh well, that's pretty much it. And like I said, I did not find any review, so it's just gonna be merely on my tasting and my opinion on this drink. So let's just freaking try this, shall we? And as always, I'm gonna do that moment. Are we ready? It's been a while since I did this because I haven't been filming as much as I like to, so spare me, shall we? Here we go. Oh yeah. I keep smelling it and it smells really bad. It smells like medicine. See, I hate cherry flavors because it's literally a hit or miss. Because people for some reason think, oh, medicine flavor is good no 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 there's a reason why we all cry as babies when we have to get medicine because it tastes like crap so I don't know why people thought it was okay but I gotta do it for the video you know <laughs> okay here we go I'm not having another sip. Hell no. Are you kidding me? This is a no. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Who likes this? Why did they bring this back? Who asked for this? I can see why they took a long time bringing that because, ew, what the heck? 
Normally I like ginger ale on its own, but this is a no for me. Big flat no, this is like a freaking 2 out of 10. It literally tastes like cherry medicine. That is literally the best way I can describe it, cherry medicine. And also have a little bit of bitterness into it. And the aftertaste, it tastes weird. It tastes like watered down cherry for the aftertaste. It's not a good taste either. I don't taste any ginger of it, blah, blah, blah. I definitely do taste the cherry, but it's not coming off like a cherry. Like I said, it tastes like medicine, and it's not very good. I don't recommend this at all. This is just a no. See, I thought if I taste it again, I'll have like a second opinion, but my opinion tastes it. I can't even think straight because this is disgusting. What the heck? I'm sorry, but if you actually like this, then you have no taste. I know that's mean to say, but straight up, this is disgusting. The only thing that's pretty is the freaking packaging and the color of the bottle. So... Anything else, it's a no. I'm going to take it down to 1 out of 10 because... Ugh, disgusting. Mm -mm -mm, that's a no for me. I'm sorry. I don't recommend this. I don't think you should try it. But if you want to try it for a mere... Curious, bleh, don't even try it. Don't even be curious about it. No. Mm-mm. I wish the aftertaste would go away. So I do want to mention like the packaging and everything. I forgot to mention that. I want to move on from the tasting. This is what it looks like. This is the everything is all red for a black cherry. It's pretty. This is what it looks like, and this is everything in it. So I mean. That was my review. I'm sorry if it was a short video. There's, Like I said, there was not a lot that I could do on this product because it just came out and it's going away very quickly. And this was just a t taste test basically. So that's it. That's my review. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Give this video a like. Subscribe if you want to see more reviews. And let me know what else I should try and let me know in the comments below and follow my social media to tell me too. Because I also do other reviews on there and there so you should go check it out. So stay hydrated. Have a good night. Good morning. Just have a good one. Okay. And bye.